Acute myeloid leukemia is a cancer of the bone marrow, and it just completely takes away the function of the bone marrow, so it can't make any blood. And most importantly, it can't make any white blood cells. So because of that, the patient is at really great susceptibility to infection, and it's an acute process that comes on rapidly and is, is quickly fatal without any sort of treatment. Essentially, all of the patients are treated with this standard chemotherapy, which is both toxic and relatively ineffective. This trial is called the BEAT AML trial because that's exactly what we're trying to do. Currently, there are about 11 sites around the country that have been selected for this. We're the only one in Texas, really the only one in the south or anywhere near in this region. In this trial, patients with newly diagnosed acute myeloid leukemia who are 60 years of age or older have rapid molecular phenotyping of their disease. So we quickly sequence with several genes so that we understand within a week or less what molecular drivers are driving these patients' disease. And that tells us what are targets that we can take some drugs and give the patients that specifically hit those targets. It is really personal. I mean, we, we take care of patients, and I've known over the years just hundreds of patients with leukemia. And we've won some and we've lost some. And so you just have this strong sense of we're not doing well enough. And so the goal of this is that we're going to completely change the way that we treat these patients and that we'll have a lot of success where we didn't used to have success before.